Despite a late rally, the Ohio women's basketball team fell for the first time this season Saturday night as the East Carolina Pirates invaded the Convo and left with a 76-68 victory over the Bobcats. The Bobcats came out of the gates on fire, looking like an undefeated basketball team should. Kiera Lampkins and Lexi Baldwin led the Cats, who started the game on 11-2 run. East Carolina then started to put the pressure on the Bobcats with a full court press. The press worked as the Bobcats started to take bad shots and turn the ball over. The Pirates went on a 7-0 run of their own to make it an 11-9 game. Two crucial three-pointers from Kiana Black put a stop to the bleeding for the Bobcats. Black finished the night with a team-high 17 points. ECU kept the pressure up for the rest of the first half and heading into the locker room, the Pirates had a slim 32-30 lead over Ohio. The Cats came out of the half with three point guards to counteract the full court press from the Pirates. The Pirates provided the Cats with their toughest test all season, and with 11-14 remaining in the second half, the Bobcats had a 47-46 lead. Shea Nelson for the Pirates hit a deep three with 8.47 left in the game as a part of a 16-0 run that opened the game up for the Pirates. ECU were on fire from beyond the arc in the second half, shooting 60% from three point land in the second half. The Bobcats, on the other hand, struggled from three, only shooting 28% for the game. The Bobcats did all they could to come back, but the Pirates and the lead proved to be too much for Coach Bob Bolden and his players. Drastically different. We haven't seen anybody like that um, all year. You know, JMU will be similar, Central Michigan will be similar. Uh, time will tell if they're as athletic as, as ECU when we get to see them live. But, you know, they're, they're long, they're athletic, they play hard. Um, you know, they're, they're, a tough team to, they're a tough team to play. With the loss, the Bobcats fall to 6-1 on the season. The Bobcats have nine days off and will look to bounce back on Monday, December 15th when James Madison visit Athens. For WOUB Sports, I'm Clay Benjamin.